Hello, Peter. Hello, Coco. Come in and sit down. Thank you for turning in your essay on graduates and employment, but I've asked you to come here to talk about a special problem you have in your writing. What kind of problem? Your writing contains many topicalized sentences. What do you mean? Well, look at this sentence. For job hunting, it is difficult. What does it refer to? Job hunting. Why did you introduce job hunting at the beginning of the sentence and then use it to repeat the term? Because I want to emphasize job hunting. That's my topic. You've put your topic in the most prominent position at the beginning of the sentence. This sentence is a topicalized sentence. Oh, I see. Don't know why I did that. Probably because your native language is Chinese. In Chinese, Emphasis is given to the topic of the sentence. So how can I improve this problem? Just take out the extra words. The word it is redundant as it stands for job hunting. So take out it that leaves for job hunting is difficult. That doesn't sound right. That's because the sentence is still not correct. In English, the sentence subject is important. Your sentence subject is job hunting. So take out anything in front of the subject, job hunting. Take out four, that leaves job hunting is difficult. Correct, what a smart girl. Now you have followed English sentence construction. Can you show me another example of a topicalized sentence? Yes, here. Concerning the employment situation, it is not predictable. You can correct this sentence in the same way. Okay, take out it and concerning. Bingo! That leaves the employment situation is not predictable. I think I'm beginning to understand. Well, let me show you some examples from your data analysis. Look at this sentence. In Table 4, it indicates the job satisfaction rate. This is also a topicalized sentence. Can you correct that? Mm, take out it and in, table four indicates the job satisfaction rate. That's great. Do you know any other way to correct this sentence? Um, from table four, we can see the job satisfaction rate. Perfect. You're a really fast learner, Coco. Thanks. How about this sentence? According to table six, it shows many graduates found a job within six months. That should be? Mm. Table 6 shows many graduates found a job within six months. Right. How about this one, Coco? According to Cornwell, 2015, he believes graduates should attend careers fairs. Mm. Cornwell. Cornwell, 2015, believes Graduates should attend careers fairs. Super! But I have seen citations beginning with according to. Well, it is possible to do that, but then you have to write the sentence differently. How? According to Cornwell, 2015, graduates should attend careers fairs. Oh yes, why didn't I write it that way? Well, not too late. Can you correct another sentence? According to Chu, 2016, page 21, he believes internships help students develop job skills. All right. Mm. Here is the sentence. According to Chu, 2016, page 21, internships help students develop job skills. Splendid. We can look at some more examples of topicalization in your writing if you like. Are you interested? Sure, but let's have a breakfast.